Okay, Chris, so all speed, yep. new boot for Rosignol for 15, 16. So my understanding, it takes some technology from the, the performance end, so the race boots, and then some from the kind of free run end, this multi award winning all track pro 130. So, yep. so what's so special about this, this new all speed? Cool. Essentially, what we want to try and do is take a lot of the DNA, the successful DNA that we have from our race product, yep. traditional four clip, no nonsense product take all of the DNA that we have from the all track series, again where we have all of that precision, comfort fit, adaptability with the product, with the walk height mode, yeah. and try and combine and fuse all of those best features and bring it into our new all speed collection here. I think the key thing with the old speed is we want to still go down a, a customization route, route with the product, but we make an actual tangible customization that customers can actually feel instantly when they are putting the product on and actually feel straight away and visually get a different sort of look at how, how we can adapt the product and make it sort of really work to their benefit really well. And how does, it, how does that work? How do you achieve that with this group? Cool. Two things. First, first and foremost is the key thing with the liner. Yeah. yeah. So we've got a very visible story that's working on our left liner here. You can see we almost have this quilted effect around the ankle and the comfort areas around here. So what we do with this, we can put this into an oven for five minutes. You can see that that whole area instantly transforms. It goes nice and flat across there. Put it back into the product, clip it up, and you instantly get that visual comfort modified memory fit on the actual line of yeah. the boot itself. So it's a true heat mold alignment. It's a true heat mold alignment. That's it. That covers our foot, comfort side and the precision. Great out of box fit as well from the first fit side. Then we move on to the shell side as well. Yeah. What we have on the rear of the boot, we have three locators on the back of the product. Yeah. Depending on where we position the screws, we can alter the flex of the product by up to 20%. Okay, so we take a, lot, yeah. we take a, a boot here which is a 130 flex product, we can actually change this down to a 110 flex and that's progressive through all of the different models of boots that we have in the range. So this is our Elite collection which is a 98mm version, yeah, okay. we then have a Pro version which is 100mm ranging from 120 flex which we can change down to the 100. Yeah. We have a 110 flex which we can change down to 90 and we have a 100 flex which we can change down to an 80. So it's a really great versatile product that we can adapt to the customer's ability level, their performance level but also build in as they progress and they get confident, we can start them off with a low flexing product and as they increase, we can build the flex up and make yeah. the boot still sort of work. They can change it for varying conditions. Change, yeah, varying yeah. conditions as well. So is, is, this a, is this aimed at somebody that's going to be kind of skiing on piste and possibly a bit of free ride? It's piste orientated type product, but you bang on, we have the ability to alter that to the um, free ride side of things. This is compatible with the walk to ride, compatible soles, right, so we can okay. put rocket toes and heels onto this as well, so it's really easy to manoeuvre. We can work out with the new Alpine binding that we brought out, it's walk to ride and Alpine compatible as well, so really versatile all around sort of great but This product. doesn't come with a walk to ride cell, but you can get a cell. You can get that as an, uh, an option extra with the product as well. Okay, cool. It's great we have this also in our women's options. Um, so the women's were telling a great story on that. We know that women don't necessarily do the same technical detail as the guys do. They want okay. practical solutions. So rather than talking about the millimeters of the product, we're talking and calling our 98 millimeters uh, skinny fit yeah. so they can easily ident identify it with jeans. We've got a slim fit, which is our 100 millimeter product, yeah. and then a regular, which is the one or two last.